everyone, I'm Dino, your financial educator here in ING Eating Channel. Now, I will guide you how to create Google Sheet, a basic guide for beginners. But before we start, please subscribe my channel. Just click the link below and the red button below. Watch this. Now, sign in to your Gmail account. If you don't have Gmail account, so just create Gmail account para merong kang email address sa Gmail. Then, of course, include your Gmail address here and click next. Then, also your password. So, then, click next. Then, after you're inside in your Gmail account, so just upper right, merong uh, menu bar, so just click. Okay, so here. So, click mo to. Then, pagkatapos, merong drive here. So, just click. Then, of course, pagkatapos dyan, so, click mo tong plus. Then, itong Google Sheet. Then, click mo tong blank spreadsheet. So, merong template sa baba. Okay? So, kung gusto mo blank, so just click. Okay? Click mo lang to. So, click here. Then, ito na yung blank spreadsheet mo. So, you rename the spreadsheet based on your project. Okay, so click mo to. So my example is my share list. Then of course, you can include, start, create your spreadsheet. So include the names, the contact number, email address. Okay, so whatever you want to include to your project, so you can do that. Okay, so of course, you can also change color if you want. So here, just click mo lang to. Ito yung tinatawag natin na toolbar. Okay, so you can... So, the toolbar, you can change color here. So, yung ginawa ko ngayon. So, you can edit your spreadsheet. Okay? So, click mo lang to. So, itong nasa lahat ng mga toolbar na to. So, again, advice ko sa inyo, just, uh, just practice. Okay? So, toolbar, you can insert text, edit size text, change font, change color, alignment, and etc. So, marami kang magawa. So, again, Practice, okay? Practice para ma-master yung pag-create ng Google Sheet. Okay? So, lagyan ko ito ng color. Okay? And also, adjust. Then, pwede natin lagyan ng mga border. If you want. So, click mo lang to. You're here. So, click mo to para lagyan natin ng mga border para malagyan. Maganda tignan. And also, you can right-click here to insert colon. So, right mo ito. Then, click mo insert colon. Okay? Kasi you want put something like numbers okay then you also you click here to adjust column then you put numbers one two three four then then you highlight design then you drag down para automatic yung numbers okay so automatic siya so tingnan nyo so here i drag down then ito na yung mga numbers so pwede nyo then also you can change color if you want then you can right click to insert row. This here, you gusto mo lagyan ng center title. So lagay ko dito my share list. Okay, so that's my titles. I go to in front. And also, I can click here and hold. Pwede ko gagawin yan. Then of course, highlight. Then tapos na highlight niyan. Then, pwede ko i-click yung center. So, again ha, click and hold to highlight column to center the text. So, click mo to here above the toolbar to ma-center yung uh, title. So, pwede mo i-adjust the size of the text. So, click mo to kung ano kalaki yung size. So, here, example. Okay, so nakita nyo. So, as simple as that. Again, here. Pwede mo to practice and practice. So, pwede mo lagyan ng uh, border again. So, pwede mo lagyan mo. So, just highlight the column. Then, lagyan mo ng border. So, meron mga border here. So, you can choose the border. So, just follow the cursor, guys. Para maintindihan mo. Then, practice again. Then, of course, you can start encode your share list here. Your contact number. The email address. For the sake of the example. So, pwede mo lagyan to. Okay? You can put as many as you can the email address. Okay? Depende so ano klase ng project nyo ginawa. Then, change color. 
Pero maganda kasi at tingnan. Okay? To save your spreadsheet, just click share right above. So, ito. Click mo lang to. Then, pakatapos, mayroong mag-pop up. So, add email address here. So, dito mo mag-add yung email address mong sino ang maka pasok no maka access so lagay ko example pala si example is si Jessica yung email address niya nilagay ko dito then you click mo ito got it okay anyway you can put me more kung gusto mo then pagkatapos diyan click to as an editor then click here send okay so ma-notify yun si Jessica sa email address niya na add siya. you can add more email address to access your spreadsheet so kung sino yung uh, ano And also, you can get link here. Pwede mo ma-save yung makapi and save the link para ipasa mo sa person na ina-add mo dyan. Okay? So, you can save, you can copy. And also, you can adjust the restricted or the viewer or pwede mo siya ikaw lang or pwede mag-ask permission sa'yo or pwede mo siya i-open to those people na ina-add mo na mga email address. Okay? So here, sa so tignan natin, put natin here, send ko sa messenger. Start sharing the link. So, lagay natin dito. So, enter natin. Tignan natin. Okay, ito na. So, i-click. But the moment, i-click natin ito na link. Then, lumabas yung ginawa natin na shirtless. So, as simple as that. And you can add, no? Kung add naman ng email address name so pwede ka mag-add ng mga details dito okay of course if you have some uh, yung ina-add mo na mga team then yung din yung ginawa natin then pwede sila mag-additional na mga list okay so you can check that to your email address again the same thing kanina doon sa above right okay so ito na spreadsheet yung ginawa natin so nasa drive again drive of your email address. Okay? So, as simple as that. So, I hope you understand how to create Google Sheet. Alright! I hope you learned something with me today. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Just click the subscribe button and also the notification bell for the future of the video.